Supreme Court nominee Brett Kavanaugh says he agrees that Roe v. Wade decision on abortion rights is settled law. That's according to Senator Susan Collins. The Republican from Maine is a key swing vote in his nomination. Capitol Hill correspondent Jason Calvey joins us with more. Jason. Wyatt, uh, Senator Collins and Judge Kavanaugh met right here on Capitol Hill. They, she supports abortion and has promised to oppose any nominee who's hostile to Roe v. Wade. Her vote is key since Republicans have a narrow 50-49 majority here in the Senate and they can't afford a single defection on Kavanaugh if every Democrat votes no. Brett Kavanaugh's meeting today could be a deal breaker or a deal maker. The 53-year-old D.C. appeals court judge already met most Republicans. Today, he's huddling with undecided GOP Senator Susan Collins of Maine. Nice to meet you. Collins says during their two-hour meeting, they talked at great length about Roe v. Wade. Judge Kavanaugh and I had an excellent session. It was very productive. It was very informative. We covered a wide range of issues. And I look forward to his upcoming hearings in the Judiciary Committee. Collins says the Supreme Court nominee is qualified, but she's facing pressure from pro-abortion groups targeting Kavanaugh. We know where he stands. Everybody on the fat list can see that it's the anti-choice. But some Democrats do make those blanket statements. This Supreme Court nominee, Judge Kavanaugh, is going to destroy women's reproductive freedom. We already know this about him. President Trump told us that anyone from his list would be there specifically to overturn Roe v. Wade. Kavanaugh should expect these tough questions during his confirmation hearing begins September 4th. If confirmed, the 53-year-old would be the sixth Catholic on the court. Kavanaugh is expected to meet later this month with Senator Lisa Murkowski, Republican from Alaska. Both Collins and Murkowski support abortion, and their votes are crucial. Many Democrats have already said they would oppose Kavanaugh. Republicans hope to have him confirmed by the start of the court session October 1st. Wyatt. Capitol Hill correspondent Jason Calvey reporting. Thanks, Jason.